how to make a WordPress website beginners guide. So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly step by step how you could make a website and people who are still confused on how to make a website. In this video, I'm going to show you how you could make a professional and search engine optimized website, which could help you rank in Google by using WordPress. So guys, let's get started. So the first thing which you need to do is get a domain name which is your website.com and the second thing is your web hosting so this is where you store your files so you can easily get this thing from bluehost.com the link is down below it's affiliate link so when you go over there on bluehost.com you would be able to get a free domain as well as hosting just for around five dollars per month so first let's go and go over to bluehost.com so this is where we'll buy our domain and hosting so as you could see over here they give you a free domain free ssl so basically free ssl is this one so you need this and they all provide for free so all you have to do is click on get started once you're over here you can choose from the plans so you could just click on any plan just select if if you have a domain name you can put over here or just create a create a new domain name for a domain name i would always suggest put your keyword in so let's say you're creating a website for bonsai tree always make sure bonsai is in your domain name make sure to select com and then click next next fill in all your information and go to the checkout so now once you purchase all you have to do is click on login and then put in your login details and click login once you're in your bluehost dashboard all you have to do is click on my site create a site once you're over here just select wordpress use wordpress put in your site name so for for me it's going to be bon bonsai tree and then put your tagline in click next okay so I'm, just select your domain from here and remove all the plugins and click next so once your website is created all you have to do is just log into wordpress so congratulations this is how your wordpress website looks i'm gonna just if you want to look at your website just click on bonds on your website name visit site and this is how your website looks so it doesn't look that great so we are going to install a theme to make it look more professional so all you have to do is click on appearance themes so so there are a lot of free themes free themes on wordpress you can get a lot of themes but the but the one which i suggest is astra theme so all you have to do is click on appearance themes add new theme and just type astra and enter and click install once it's installed just click on activate so once it's activated all you have to do is just click on refresh page now this is how your website looks now what we have to do is just delete all the demo data so for that all you have to do is click on post select all and delete same thing with pages so all you have to do is click on pages all pages select all move to trash apply and then two important settings which we need to do is click on settings general make sure your website name and your tagline is there and also make sure your keyword is in the site title and in the tagline and then the next thing which you need to do is click on permalinks so once you're on your permalinks all you have to do is from plain you need to put on post name the reason for that is for seo purposes because your keyword comes on the domain name then all you have to do is save changes so once you install the theme for every theme there's an option to customize so when you click on appearance and customize you can open a theme so now once you're over here you can add a logo you can change everything you can change the design so i can just show it to you right now so you can just click, click on headers okay site identity and you can select a logo so to create a logo all you have to do is just search on google for free logo maker or the next thing which i do is click on fiverr and then i just type logo over here so there are people who can make logo for you just for five dollars or the next thing which i do is really professional is go to graphicriver.net and then just type logo and then you can edit this in photoshop or photo illustrator so these are the top three options once you create your logo i would highly suggest creating a logo just because it makes your pro your website looks professional so once you upload the logo all you have to do is just publish and there are a lot of other settings as well if you want to change the color everything's over here so once you are done uploading the logo and making changes on your website now i'm going to install some important plugin for seo and just for the spam so once you come on plugins click on add new so once you're over here you could just download this one anti-spam 
which helps protect your blog or your website from spam install yoast seo for search engine optimization this plugin would help you rank in google and then the last one i would suggest is this is a social sharing plugin this will help you share your blog post to other social sharing website so i would install now so once you have installed the plugin now we'll go and create some content so now all you have to do is click on post add new once you're on your post it's very easy to write a post this is your headline you can write your headline over here and then when once you choose over here you can click you can add paragraph you can add text you can add heading so if i just write paragraph you can add your paragraph over here it's very simple and easy to use you can press enter and then again you want to add you can add images if you want so i have created a post so as you could see over here this is the headline this is the paragraph this is the h2 tag and it's very easy to add all you have to do is just click here and you can see a lot of things over here and if you're wondering where do i get my images i get my images from pixabay so you can get free images from here it's very simple once you're done that you can just publish and your content would be available online also for seo one important thing which you need to do is if you want to link all you have to do is just highlight this one and just type and you can link it to you can link it to high authority website like wikipedia and then once this is done the next thing which you could do is take this image and write the alt text over here write down your keyword over here for search engine optimization and help google to know what your website is all about so once everything is done then all you have to do is just scroll down so once you scroll down you could see the seo yoast seo the plugin which we installed and this is how your post would look on google right now it doesn't look that great so all you have to do is put your focus keyword over here and then the next thing which you have to do is just click here and this is how it would look on google so if you want to change the slug which is the headline or if you want to change the description you could do it from here and a very simple tip i could give you is head over to google and see what other people are writing in their meta description and even in the headline and then come back over here and write something which is better than them also you could just click on social and you could you could just change how you could share your post on facebook and twitter so you could write your facebook title you could write your facebook description everything is customizable so one last important thing which you need to do is before you post is just add a new category you can create a new category called bonsai tree okay once this is done once you add your category you can add a feature image so once this is done you can just click on update and then you can preview so as you could see this is how our website looks when you just click click on the post as you could see it looks really good with the social sharing plugins and everything's over here so once we have written the post now there are few more things to make our website complete so first we need to create new pages so to create new pages is all you have to do is click on pages and add new you see all you have to do is click on pages add new and just click on add new and then you can write so once you're done with this you can just click on publish once this is published you could view the page so you can just click on view the page so you could see over here contact us page is here so now again we click on bonsai tree so as you could say contact us page is here so if you want to make any changes on the menu it's very simple again go back click on appearance and menu so once you're over here we can create a home menu click on contact us and add menu and save menu let's say you create a new page home page and publish come back to menu and then you can see home page add to menu you can choose the sequence from here so first we want the home page then the contact us page and then save menu so as you could see the home page is here and contact us page is here if you click on the home page right now it's currently blank so let's say you want the home page should to be the first page of your website so to do that is very simple click on settings reading and then you can choose a static page and the home page and save changes once this is done you can go back to your site so now as you could see over here your home page is the first page and now we want to add a blog over here create a blog page just type blog publish and then all you have to do is click on appearance and then all you have to do is click on settings reading again and select your post page as blog page save changes and then you want to show the blog page over here click on appearance menu view all and then blog page add to menu just go over here add to menu so which which we have already done it and then save menu so just come over here delete save menu we go back to the home page so as you could see the blog page is over here now what we could do is we need to make the home page look much more professional 
the next thing which we could do is install a free plugin called elementor click on plugins add new elementor so elementor is a free page builder it's a free drag and drop page builder so just install now and then click on activate all the tutorials are over here but you can just create your first page so once you click on create your first page it's very easy you could add anything over here it's very simple it's like a drag and drop if you want to have add header you can add your header over here you could customize whatever you want if you want to type slider you can add slides over here so i'm gonna add slides image carcel it's very easy and also they have designs as well so if you just click over here pages you can add blocks so let's say you want to install so as you could see there are a lot of templates which you could which you could use on your website so let's say we are going to use this one and click insert so as you could see here the template is loaded you can just delete it's like drag and drop so if you want to change you can change over here learn about bonsai and it's very easy to use you can change so it's very simple i've added the title over here recent post it's easy you can change the color go to style and then you can just change the text color you can decide however however you want and this is how it looks i can just click on update and then you can change the box and everything which i'm not going to do right now so as you could see i've just added an image slider and the recent post so the more posts you write it would all come over here and this is the image slider you could customize the way you want i've just added these two so there are a lot of options the way you want to customize check out the competition but make it look simple and elegant if someone clicks over here it should show the social sharing plugin everything looks good and if you would like to change this it's very simple click on customize and then you can just click on widgets or if you want you can just click over here if you want you can remove this and then this won't be there you want to show categories if you want to remove this just remove it from here and just publish and this looks really good and then it's all mobile responsive as well so everything is mobile responsive and this is how you build your very own wordpress website and i would always suggest using wordpress because it has a lot of plugins themes and it's very customizable you could customize the way you want and if you would like to know what plugins and what themes which i use head over to yavar khan resources you will come to know what themes and which plugins do i use so go and check it out over there so this is how you create a wordpress website and i would always suggest using wordpress because it has a lot of themes plugins and you know help and tutorial is readily available and it's an open and a free software so i would highly suggest using wordpress and that's it for today's video and guys if you would like to know more about how to generate more traffic how to get free traffic on your blog on your website i've created a free crash course on how to get traffic the link is down below go and get it now that's it for today's video yawar khan signing off